Hey, it's Mike and John from PumaPlow.com playing some more Farming Simulator 15 on the PC. Here in the shop. Yep. Also known as Bjorn Home. It's another mod uh, showcase video. Yep. So this time we're going to show you a couple conveyor belts. Yay, conveyor belts. Now, when you download them from the link below in the description, yep. be warned that there's two zip files inside, inside the regular zip file. Yeah. So you have to pull those two out and put them in your mod folder, not just dump the main one in there. It will not work. It's super easy, though, once we figured it out. Yeah. So there's two different conveyor belts. One shows up in telehandlers because it attaches to the telehandlers. See it here? It's pretty, right? Yep, and look at all the stuff it does. It does a little bit of everything. Potatoes. Steaming manure, I guess. And ham. Ooh, that'd be a good way to do solid manure. It would actually be a fantastic yeah, way. Yeah, it does ham. We have not tested it yet. Yeah, but anyway, we're going to test it on something very specific here in a second. There you go. Okay, and then there's the front loader one, which attaches to a front loader, right? Yep. They're the same basic operation, so we're only going to show you one of them. Yeah. So here we go. This right. is the front loader one, right? Yep. We're at a silage pit. John's driving the truck. The stupid part is it shows the percentage of silage on the auger or on the conveyor belt. It's 100%. Belt. It's, around, it's around 96. It goes, it's up and down on my inspector. You should turn your inspector off, by the way. I forgot about that. Um, okay, inspector's off. But okay, yeah, do I need to pull forward? Yeah, I say I'm not filling okay. now, so you need to pull forward a so little bit. So yeah, so bit. you basically have to keep going as it goes to keep pulling forward and backwards and whatever. Yeah, so that's why it'd be good for like solid manure because it doesn't really move that much. Oh yeah, it'd be great for that. So it would be pretty awesome for that. And uh, wood chips. Yep. It does wood chips, right? Uh, no, remember we no, tested right. it. It doesn't do. It doesn't do wood chips for some reason. Of all things, it doesn't do. It doesn't so do wood chips. We still need a. We still need a conveyor belt for wood, wood chips. Yeah. But so. you really don't need to store wood chips. No, but if you are storing them. Simply because you just don't need to. So after I'm full here in just a second, why don't you like show the people how it moves? Okay. Um, I'm almost full. So you use your front loader controls like you would a bucket, let's say? Yeah. They're actually, so, you need to back out of the pile right now. That way it empties, remember? Okay, hang on. Let me get Because otherwise it actually will store okay. stuff. Okay, move. So I'm 96%. Okay, so here's how this thing works. Left button on the mouse. Yep. does your forward and reverse tipping yeah it's kind of funny looking but and then actually the other handle extends it but if you go too far you're going to tip your front loader so don't do that yeah and we've got um, a heavy you know what you could do john what's that oh no never mind so see you could put it over a wall but that wouldn't really work <laughs> that would look silly but anyway in transport i transport it like this yeah the other mouse button doesn't do anything nope it's just the one mouse button it's got your four basic directions you know tip it and uh you know i don't know why you'd ever want to raise it like this tip it then forget it you could i guess I mean, if yeah, you basically, really you're going to transport it like that, let's say. Yeah, yeah. And totally. then you're going to tip it to use it. Yep. And that's really all you're going to do to this thing. Yeah. But it makes short work out of emptying and silage. Why don't you on um, back up a little bit more and unhook it just to see how, okay. it, how it lays? Well, I'm going to set it down. That's probably I know how idea. it unhooks. Okay. We're going to go down with it because when you unhook it, it's just going to chill like that. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. So it's going to make short work of silage of if you want to use your solid manure for something. Uh, if you have a map that has grass st storage or wheat storage, straw, straw storage, you know, one of the modded maps that'll work yep. for that. Yeah, yeah. But, but yeah. Well, it works for silage, so I'm happy. Pretty much. So you'll be seeing it soon on our um, on our stream map. Darn right. So that's the uh, silage uh, conveyor belt thingy. There you go. Until next time, we're Mike and John from PumaPlow.com. See ya. Toodles.